Hey guys, it's Ryan back here again, and today we're reviewing Star Wars Movie Heroes, Obi-Wan Kenobi. He's from Wave 2 of Movie Heroes in 2012, and the retail price is $8.99. Here's a nice look at the back of the packaging. This version of Obi-Wan Kenobi is a completely new sculpt, and it's one of the very few first Star Wars figures in the foreign scale to have a light of lightsaber. The detailing is very nice, and the paint applications aren't too bad either. On the back of the figure, you can get a better look at the sculpting work that went into his boots, his Jedi robe, and his belt. He's primarily painted in white for his clothing, and on the back of his head he has a ponytail sculpted in. Compared to the other Obi-Wan Kenobis released in 2012, this one is definitely far superior with the head sculpt. It's more accurate and it's got some great fine detailing. Sculpted onto his belt is multiple pouches and gadgets which are painted in gold, brown, and black. On the back of the belt is a larger pouch which is painted in tan. To turn on the light up feature, you press a button on his belt which illuminates the lightsaber. Weapons and accessories include a figure stand, a card, and a die. And the articulation for Obi-Wan includes a ball jointed head, swivel shoulders, ball hinged left elbow, swivel left wrist, swivel hips, and ball hinged knees. So for about $9, you get a brand new Obi-Wan Kenobi with an excellent head sculpt and a brand new light up feature. I think this is a great start by Hasbro, and I'm definitely looking forward to more of them in the future. So anyways, that pretty much does it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next video.